I've ever been to. Ever, ever. I love that I have Tennessee minus 12 and a half. I thought it was going to be a trap game. It's not a trap game. Ball's my 50. Ball, ball's my 50. Alright, blocked extra point, blocked extra point. Tennessee up 7-6, four minutes, four minutes to go. And let me tell you something. Balls first, balls nation, balls nation, let's ride. But second, come here, I got a secret. I kind of like World of for the lives. Well, balls nation, 7-6, let's go boys. They score a touchdown and then they miss the extra point. Uh, it's hard to hit extra points when the field goals are new, the posts are new, so it's hard. Um, but let me just say something. 13 to 6, I'm feeling good about Tennessee. They move the ball whenever they want. They, they've had three drives, and one of them they kick themselves in the face, so I feel good that the offense can keep it going because the other two drives where they don't beat themselves up, they score. I like good old rock top. I like to see minus 12 and a half still. Good old Rocky Top. Woo! Rocky Top, Tennessee. All right. 26. We need 62, boys. I've got the over on 61 and a half. And Tennessee minus 12 and a half. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Good song. Rocky Top. Woo! Alright, getting a little chillier, so, but it's not that chilly, but you get the point. 27-6, uh, halftime. We need, couple, we need to keep that offense going. We need Kentucky to start scoring so we can cover the over. I love Tennessee. Tennessee's offense just runs up and down the field. Feels like they can just score whenever they want. I really like what Tennessee is doing. Also, Neyland, just a quick little talk about Neyland. Their light show is unbelievable. They've got the best light show in the country. And nighttime in Neyland is different, man. It is different. This place is sweet. Sweet. A little bit cramped, though. I'm not going to lie. Neyland's a little bit cramped, and they take their sweet time at the concession stands. But other than that, it's nice. Man, look how cramped it is. But anyway, it's nice. Hit it. 37 to 6 with three minutes to go. Four minutes to go in the third quarter. 
Beat down. It's over. Now we just need boys to hit the over. This tennis. They're winning that championship. I'm buying a ticket tonight. National championships. National championship runs through Neela Stadium. Nash Championship Road through Knoxville, boys and girls. Alright, UT wins, beats the heck out of Kentucky. I mean, they're not even close. I mean, the game wasn't even close. Tennessee moved the ball up and down the field. You can hear them right now. We're leaving early just to beat traffic. And by the way, we're not even beating traffic because we're leaving so. Good old Rocky Top. Woo! Rocky Top Tennessee. Woo! We sang Rocky Top more than anybody. And I've hit, I've said so many go balls that people are like, oh, what part of Tennessee are you from? I'm from, I'm from Tennessee. Don't worry. I'm from the only 10 I see, which is me. Anyway, recap, I can't wait to do it later in the studio. Tennessee wins big. National champions, honestly. I'm, right now, I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna buy a ticket for Tennessee to win the national championship. That's how good they are. Thanks for watching, make sure you like and subscribe. If you like and subscribe this video, it's 100% free. All right, let's throw it to the All studio. Right, back here in the studio, I got a hat that is way too big. I look like a doofus, uh, but, you know, it, it felt right. If I, and I got a shirt that's a little too big too, but I was told that it was going to shrink. So, you know what? Whatever. I'm getting bigger anyway. I'm becoming a big boy. Uh, all right. So, let's talk about my experience uh, at Tennessee. I thought it was great. I thought it was a great time. I'm going to do a couple rankings. I've got four rankings that I would like to talk to you about. Fan experience, campus, team, and fans, and then we'll do an overall score. For fan experience, look, Neyland Stadium – Obviously, it's kind of a cathedral of college football. I mean, over 100,000 fans, but they make it feel like – I talked about it at the halftime uh, portion, but they put you in there like sardines. You feel like you're packed the whole entire time, and it feels super cramped. Uh, but the stadium is sweet. The atmosphere around the stadium is so sweet. The stadium is a great stadium. The light show, night game – Tennessee is as good as it gets when it comes to the fan experience inside of the stadium. I, I've been to 100 games. It's up there with the best of them. Campus. The University of Tennessee campus is so hilly. It's unbelievable. I finally It clicked into my brain that why it's Rocky Top. Because it is feels like you're in the middle of a mountain. If I was a student, if I was a student wanting to go to a college, you got to think about those December days when you're trying to walk to class. Holy cow, that'd be murder, murder. Um, so, but it's a beautiful campus. They got huge buildings. I give it about a seven point six. All right, Tennessee Volunteers team. They're winning the national championship. I'm convinced of it. I don't know if it's the fans. I don't know if it was the atmosphere. That team is winning the national championship. That team is a ten out of ten. They move the ball up and down whenever they want, and that offense is so well run. I love it. I love the Tennessee Vols this year. Now, the fans, they're super nice, very friendly, but I have to say, and they're very excited, feel, feels like 98 there, but I have to say they're sort of dumb. They're up, uh, it's the fourth quarter, I think they're up 30 points, and they're like, hey, why are we running the ball? Why are we running the ball? We got to throw the ball, throw the ball. It's like, wait, hey, man, whoa, hey, chill, man, we're just trying to run at the clock. I don't understand why, we're just throwing the ball. It's like, okay, they just... 
I feel like they're just not the smartest fans. There's more. And, and then we were at a Walgreens in Nashville. And we're leaving uh, the Walgreens at, from Nashville to go to Knoxville. And we have, obviously, all of our Tennessee stuff. And the lady that's checking us out going, so you're going down to Knoxville to see the see our Tennessee Volunteers? And I was like, yeah, it's going to be a tough game. You guys are good so far. She goes, well, you obviously don't know anything about Tennessee. The hard part of our schedule just happened. And I didn't have the heart to tell her, like, Kentucky, top 20, Georgia, SEC championship, college football, uh, playoff, final, final four, and then the national champ. You still have – the five hardest – anyway, they beat Alabama. They're like, yep, our schedule's over. This season's it. We won the national championship. Uh, so the fans are a little bit dumb. But you know what? They have a lot of excitement, and they're extremely nice, so they make up for it. I gave the fans like an 8.7. So overall, uh, the Tennessee trip, I gave it a 9.4. I think if you're a college football fan, I think that if you live, breathe, and die college football, you have got to go see it. It is such a cool stadium. It's cool fans, cool tradition. Uh, and just an absolute amazing, amazing time. So yeah, thank you for watching. God bless. If you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Uh, it's completely free. And if you comment, Pierce, it is completely free just today and today only. Thank you for watching. God bless. Go Vol.